Hello everybody, we're here for XCOM 2, getting the interstellar regulators. We've made about probably 15 to 20 of the people in the Discord. I figured that should be more than enough if uh, people do end up getting uh, killed off, sadly, which could happen. I'm not the best in this game, so I see that could happen. Um, we have a ton of mods on here. I think my total mod list is like 70 or 80. So, and I have the War of the Chosen mod, uh, or not mod, the DLC, Shen's Gift, or I have all the DLC except for like one, which is like a character customization one here. Um, mostly, the biggest change you see is that we'll be using the Advent to the Empire mod, which uh, changes all of the Advent forces to the Empire. Um, I had a little bit of a problem with that when I did my trial run with the or the chosen, so I had to disable the introduction there. Um, but other than that, you know, hopefully everything else will run smoothly. We have some aliens and uh, custom uniforms and ODSTs and just a little bit of everything here for um, XCOM 2 and our ISR forces. So I didn't actually think it would take uh, this long to uh, load up the uh, the Avenger or whatever it's called. I think that's what it's called, the little like sky ship or something. But hopefully it'll load up here in a second for us. Other than that, loading is kinda long. I think what I'll do is um, I'll show mostly footage from the missions. I won't show too much in terms of stuff going on behind the scenes at the base unless um, I show like the bonding and RPG elements because I have an RPG mod overhaul which uh, we got Jedi classes and commandos and medics and uh, it's it's a pretty cool mod I will say that I haven't you know dove too deep into the modding of XCOM 2 so I definitely need to see um, more of what it has to offer here are we actually gonna ever get into uh, into the Avenger something tells me uh, Probably not. So one second, let me cut a quick for us. All right, everybody. After a uh, bit of a long loading, there finally got into Operation Gate Crasher. I'm um, looking around at our people here. I see one is uh, my brother. I think the other one is Fixer, who's like our Wookie representation there. Um, back in the top right, I think that's. Uh, that might be Flash? I'm not sure. We'll definitely see here in a second. I do have a mod on that increases the squad size to about like 9 people or something. Um, because anything more, it's just getting too chaotic and loading, I guess. Because uh, it already took a while here. It took like an extra 5 minutes from when I did the intro. So, um, let's see, let's see. Here comes our group. Oh, that's, a, that's a big group. Okay, I wasn't expecting that for the first mission, all these people. Alright, um, well then. <laughs> Especially because this, this first mission is not difficult at all. So let's take a, take a, list our, uh, take a look here at our Royster. We got my brother. We got Osiris. That's who it is actually. Fixer. We have a Reaper with us. We got Chains. Uh, who's the stars? Elf. Yeah, well, there's Flash. And, uh, Viv. So we got a good little list here. I wish we could kind of move them all out at once, honestly, because I know we're just gonna go and sweep the enemies. Let's get the shadow going. I don't know why I said shadow. I meant, uh, Reaper. I'm not too, too familiar with them, um, honestly. I'll say that, so... I highly doubt there will be enemies around this way, so let's just keep on moving up. I know, saying this area here is uh, like we where we get detected. I find it hard to believe that they don't already uh, detect us, though. Yes, sir. One thing, though, with the larger forces, it does take a while to uh, move everybody everywhere. 
chains representing the clan skirt skirt fixer another guy representing the clan skirt skirt there try to get these guys moved up shouldn't shouldn't be too much let's see can we go inside this building There's my brother right there. Imagine our big old list of people and we're just gonna I'm gonna get a big advantage on them. So we'll get about right here. Try to get everybody like on the same position. These guys make up the bulk of the advent forces we've dealt with. They're disciplined. There's the Empire right there. I need to actually turn the sound on. Call Sky Ranger and turn. Edit options. Get that audio just a little bit. There we go. Just just a little bit louder. So you guys can hear the dialogue when it actually goes off. Moving out. All right. Keep on moving people up. Revealed. Oh, because you smashed the glass, of course. Civilians, everybody's running everywhere. Of course. Alright, well, let's see if it's going crazy. Affirmative, sir! Have this guy try to get the high ground here. Come on, Flash. That's right. Let the expert handle it. Moving to position. Overwatch. Wow, I actually got him. Still not revealed, wow. Flash did get a little dinged up there, but he's good. Come get some. Okay, I'll go. Come get some. So much for stealth there, right? Move into position. Set up ambush. Oh, 
an awesome cover there. The Advent officers seem more capable than the grunts. We're not sure whether to chalk it up to training or stricter mind control. Tell my kids I see that! Here they come for us. Destroying the cover there for us. Already on the first episode. Not e not even oh, episode that. Pants on. Still not revealed, wow. On it, squad leader. Just stay clear of my fire, Delta. Dinged up also. Hi, sir. Sir, you know patience is a virtue. Picking up any inbound contacts. 
Scanners are clear. Menace one five, we have a limited window to act before Advent responds. We need to get those charges planted on the double. Man, that was that was rough though. Already first episode, Flash just gets deemed. And he was like he all the way up on the top of the building well. with cover too. He had the high ground. Like how that happened. So dang guys. I don't know. I must move quickly. Moving into position. Menace one five, we have a limited window to act before Advent responds. We need to get those charges planted on the double. All right, let's Menace do this. one five, rendezvous at the extraction point. Status confirmed. Squad is clear. Detonating charge. All right, let's take a look at the uh, mission debriefing. Nothing for Dars. Nothing for Bolton. Girl Gamer. Krista. Viv was the MVP. Sneakiest. That was, uh, was pretty good. All right, well, uh, we did it. We completed the mission. However, uh, Flash did not make it back. Then again, I wasn't expecting all nine people for that like little tutorial first mission they give you, so. Just see what we're uh, what we're left with here. So, all right. Oddly enough, uh, Raven did not level up. Bond available between Dars and Fixer. All right, that must be playing some Fallout. Eventually it'll promote him. One day. <laughs> as long as there's even one Reaper left standing, you can bet they're still in the fight. Finger on the trigger. Tactician. Brother becomes a Jedi all of a sudden. All right, everyone. Well, that's uh, that's our group there for today. Commander. Having these two soldiers continue to work together has paid off. They know each other well enough at this point that we can have them train as a pair for additional tactical capabilities. <laughs> that face, though. It's a hey, out there, my resistance brother. psychos! Do you crave the excitement of battle? Are you eager to get back at the aliens for all the horrible things they've done to our planet? Well, have I got news for you! All you have to do is visit your local city center and shoot your nearest Advent Peacekeeper in the face! Do your part today! Commander, the media is a powerful tool. Just ask Advent's propaganda machine. I say it's time we turn it against them. By spreading the word of our soldiers' exploits in combat, we can bolster morale throughout the Resistance. Commander.
Commander, each of our soldiers has a unique relationship with their squad mates. Let's not do that one, because together, I feel like... Their compatibility huh. will grow and can eventually develop into a lasting bond. Okay, I, I didn't think I hit chains. I thought I hit a silence. Back but okay. online was a miracle. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure how he deciphered their system, but we'd still be half buried in the sand if he hadn't. He gave everything he had to get the ship running, but he didn't live long enough to see her fly. We owe you both a debt of gratitude. You can honor his memory by using this ship to destroy the aliens wherever we find them. You'll get no argument here. If anything, I. All right, everybody. Well, that's going to do it here for today. I'm going to bump down the audio just a little bit because I didn't think it was going to be that much louder with all them speaking. Uh, we'll see you all next time for some more ISR in XCOM 2. Hopefully, we can keep more people alive, bond more people. Um, I don't know if you can do multi-bonds. I guess not. I don't know if you can sever a bond. Um, who knows? But until then, everyone, we'll see you all next time. Peace out.